Hi, excuse me. Hi, I'm so sorry to bother you. I'm selling this watermelon to get some money for my mom's medication. Do you think you can help me out with a couple bucks? I'm sorry, I only have 50 cents. Um, I'm so embarrassed asking you. You only have 50 cents to help me? That's all I have. Are you sure that's, that's it? That's it, that's all I have. And, and you, you're willing to help me with everything you have? Yes, sir. Are you serious? Yeah. What's your name? Carrie. Carrie, I'm, I'm so glad like you helped me. Uh, what is the reason you decided to help me though? Because I didn't need 50 cents right now. I, you didn't need them, but I do. Yeah. Wow, if you don't mind me asking, like, is, is that where you live? This is your tent? Yeah. Uh, and, and do you usually, like, are able to, like, fit in there? Do, do you mind if I walk there? Yeah. Um, so you usually just sleep right here? Yeah, me and my dog. And, and you and your dogs sleep there, wow. Yeah, my dogs sleep there. If you don't mind me asking, like, how did you end up living on the streets and what exactly happened? Um, it's, it's just a long story, you know? Life happened wherever, you know, and, uh, yeah, the reason I'm asking you this is because I meet a lot of people on the streets and not everybody's on the street because of the drugs. People usually think because of drugs, people are on streets, which is not true. Everybody has a different story. Life happens, bad times. Technically time. speaking, um, yeah, I'm, I'm homeless because I do drugs because I refuse to get clean under, um, and be uncomfortable in my own skin yeah. for someone else's um, wanting to or, you know, it's, it has nothing to do with me. I, I'm uncomfortable doing it what I do you know, and no 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 and ag again I appreciate the honesty but a lot of people I'm here to you know like to just just listen to your story so how how did you get involved with with with, with drugs what happened my father fed me a bunch of pills when I was like a kid and shit and guinea pig me into a put me in a program and guinea pig me for like three years There's no way so your dad literally so got you, you into this. Yeah, what do you think is going to happen if you put a kid on a billion different pills to try to see which one works? Oh my god, I am so sorry that you had to go through this. And how many years ago was that? How old were you? 15 years ago, I got... 15 years ago? No, 15 years ago, I lost my children. That's what happened. In, oh, I'm uh, so sorry. I, I mean, I, I went into the program when I was 15 and I got out when I was 17 and a half. Wow. And, um, and then my dad kicked me out when I was 18. Wow, so you were kicked out when you were 18 and you started doing this when you were 15 years old? No, I started doing this when I was 18 years old, almost 19. Okay, so when you were kicked out, that's when you started getting into yeah, drugs. So not only did he put me for a bunch of medications, but then turned around and kicked me out. So how long are you here on the streets for? How old are you now? 15 years, I've been on this. 15 years, so you were 18 years old and now you're like 33? Some, no, something I like? was, I was, uh, when I got back from New York, that was about 16 years ago and I was probably about 33 okay let, let me let me ask you and again it's none of my business do you ever think about you want to change you want to you know be out but of the streets I, or I do it what I do is comfortable you, you're comfortable, I, comfortable with what you do I don't bother nobody else no 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 yeah you're not I don't put nobody in danger you know even no, you're not. my kids with me they wouldn't be in danger because I'm a very responsible and sensible person you know? wow so, how many kids do you have and where do they live There with the dad or? One's with my dad, one's with um, his aunt on his dad's side, and my daughter is in CPS custody. Oh wow, okay, I'm so sorry, you know, you had to go. And once, once one's gone, then the next one's gonna be gone, and the next one, it doesn't matter how much you put. They wow. want them all now because all it takes is to say so. That, that, that is so true. And, and are, we're, we're, I, I see you picking up things, and are you tr trying to like leave from here? I'm embarrassed to be doing this video with you right now with all this shit everywhere because I don't live like this. I just like threw my team here because I was like, uh, I just got back to town and uh, where, where are you gonna move back to now? Where are you going? I'm gonna move my tent somewhere where there's shade and where it's clean. You know? Oh, yeah, it's more clean yeah, and more okay. I, 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 I've been up for like a clock. No, 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 I totally well, I totally respect your time and I appreciate you giving me the 50 cents here. I wanna, I wanna give you that 50 cents back. Because this was actually a social experiment. I went to so many people, nobody wanted to help me. You're the first person that decided to do that. So I want to go ahead and give you this um, this watermelon. There's actually something in there for you. God bless you, okay? Yes. All right.